Hi, this is Gordon from Can Archery, and today we're going to review the new TrueFire Synapse. We're going to do a quick overview of the whole product, and then we're going to show you the adjustability and the functions of this new release. Okay, so right now we're going to talk about the TrueFire Synapse release in detail. Now, as you see here, right away you're going to see the indication of tension and travel. For Compared to most releases, this actually has a lot of tension and a lot of travel. It goes from 1.25 ounces to 20 ounces of tension and the travel is quite a lot of adjustments as well. Now I have it set right now at a really low setting, but you can play around with it until you get comfortable with it. The uh, couple, I'm gonna show you a little bit about the barrel adjustment and also the lever adjustment here. The barrel adjustment is done with just loosening up this Allen key in there, and you, once you loosen that up, you can rotate it any angle you like, left-handed or right-handed. Also as well, if you remove these, you can actually adjust it the barrel any way you like as well. You can move it to um, you move it closer or farther or even on the other side. Okay. Now what I'm gonna talk about is the release itself. It is brass, so it is quite heavy. It is PVD coated. It comes in five different colors. It comes in this blue here you see here. It comes in silver, red, um, orange, and green. Now I'm going to show you a little couple more different functions on this release. It also has the cord attachment and the way the release works is basically um, it comes in a three finger and also it comes in a four finger. And I'm going to show you how to change this from a three finger to a four finger. It's very simple. All you do is remove the back set screw that holds the fourth finger in. Once you remove it, you're going to pop the pin out. So there's a pin that goes on the bottom of this. Pop the pin out and the pin will drop the fourth finger out. Now to put the other finger attachment in, you're going to loosen the screw and you are going to put the set screw into the new fourth finger and I'll show you the reason why you need to do that. Okay, once you get that done, you're gonna drop it into the new release and you're gonna put the pin back in. Okay, now the reason why you need the two set screws in there is I'm gonna show you. You can adjust the level of how much this rocks back and forth by just turning the two set screws until you find a, a balance point where you want this fourth finger to be. Now, if you look carefully here as well, there's also gradient lines on the back here. It kind of tells you where you are in relative to the angle of this fourth finger. Other functions of the release as well is the cocking mechanism. So it's very simple. Similar to other releases, the jaw is open. You close the jaw, you press the release, or sorry, the reset button, and the jaw stays locked. Once you press the trigger button, the jaw opens back up again. You can also lock it and then push this close as well and it will stay locked. Okay, this is the True Fire Synapse release. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna bring it down to the range and we're gonna shoot a couple arrows with it. So right now, it's set up as a three finger and I have the uh, spring adjusted pretty, pretty hot and the travel about, I'd say about medium travel. The way I'm gonna shoot this release is that pretty much I hook on and I tend to put the barrel of the release in the palm of my hand because I don't want to put it near the thumb because it's, it's going to cause me to punch the trigger. So I want to put it close to where my base of my hand is. And what I do is when I anchor, I'm going to keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling until the release goes off. So the natural closure of your hand by pulling back makes this release go off. And because of the infinite settings, or pretty much infinite settings of the tension, you can set it really, really light. Um, I find, like I said before, I find the lightness setting a little bit too light. This is Gordon from Canada Archery Online, and this is the True Fire Synapse. Go to your local shop and try them out. You'll be pleasantly surprised.